A search is underway in the Utah countryside for the bodies of victims of serial killer Ted Bundy. Bundy was executed in Florida six months ago. But as Allison Barlow of KSLV, KSL TV reports, the new search began when Bundy's initials were found carved in trees in the area. Search and rescue volunteers gathered in the little town of Mount Pleasant. 120 men and women from 18 counties of Utah and Nevada. I just can't say enough on how we appreciate you gentlemen coming down and helping us. Because it is a big job. Almost impossible. The crews had hundreds of acres to cover. Ted Bundy's deathbed confessions led searchers to San Pete County. And earlier this spring, they did find some unidentified human remains at the site where Bundy claimed he buried Deborah Kent. We are not looking for the Deborah Kent site. That site has been closed until we find more evidence. We are going into other sites looking for other remains that are possibly in San Pete County. During his deathbed confession, Ted Bundy adamantly denied ever carving his name in a tree. But trees like this on eight sites are the last hope searchers have of ever finding any evidence in this vast area. You just have a unit say they found a TEB on a tree. When searchers looked, they found bones by many trees, most of them obviously from animals. But volunteers said they had to give it one more try. The reason's always the same. You know, a family cannot put this to a close until they have some kind of proof. Some of the bones will go to the medical examiner's office, but Sheriff Buchanan says unless they come up with something definite, this was the last official search. That report by Allison Barlow of KSL-TV.